This is the UCLA Inventathon. It's a hackathon for medical devices and software. They're trying to solve some needs out there in the real world. Well, I hope that out of this hackathon, or this Inventathon, I should say, that students create something that's really useful, that hospitals can use, that people in the medical profession can use, and that patients can use to improve their quality of life. That would be awesome. Basically, we're presented with 10 like medical needs that we have to find a solution for, create just like a PowerPoint presentation or create the product itself that would solve like a scenario that we're presented with. And we have 24 hours. There's only three of us right now. Um, we have a computer science major. He's an electrical engineering major. And I hope to contribute my vast knowledge of medicine. <laughs> <laughs> to the competition, but yeah, basically we're just a group of three for now. Right now we're keeping our options open until we've uh, formed our full team. Do y'all already have a group? No, I don't. Uh, are you, what year are you? I'm second year grad, uh, master's in uh, biology. Uh, do you want to join ICA? We're six and a half hours in and we have like 18 left. We found a group with two people that are actually like at the business school of Anderson right now so we hope that that would be a good group to win this competition. We were thinking of the elderly don't take their medicine, they're like not compliant about that so we're trying to think of a solution to that with like an automated pill box type of thing that would make it easier for them to take their medicine. All you have to do is build the app. It has to have, it has to have like a chat feature um, which could also include FaceTime and geolocation and what else would it be? And that we're using, we're applying like the principles of modern social networking in a way that's friendly to the the throat is getting sore, the eyes are getting tired, the fingers are getting weary, fingers flying. My emotional state is great. I'm, I'm pretty happy. I've uh, been drinking a lot of coffee. Luckily, they, they brought us plenty of caffeine today, so doing good in that regard. We got three hours of sleep last night and then came in this morning and actually completely changed our idea. So we pretty much uh, built, it, built our project from scratch this morning. Uh, so the new idea is that we've created a, it's a web app that is cross-platform mobile compatible. It's very, very friendly to elderly patients. It's designed so even the most technologically adverse person uh, is able to use this app. There's like two buttons, it's very, very simple. And in addition, there's a more complex version that can be used by a child, a caregiver of just a loved one in general. And basically the idea is that it's, uh, it provides peace of mind, it provides data collection, it provides uh, intrinsic psychological motivation for elderly people to uh, take their medicine. In about 30 minutes, we're gonna have to go in and we're gonna have to pitch this to the judges, the CEOs of biomedical companies and venture capitalists. And then after that, we're gonna have to demo our actual product. So we're probably gonna do a computer demo. We're gonna show them what our homepage looks like. We're gonna show them how it works on an iPad on an Android device. And we'll probably have to explain the uh, back end of it a little bit. Who maybe would be comfortable using a little bit of, you know, a, a, a user interface like this where they have to hit a button or two. The time is 4.09 p.m. We're all gathered around. Everyone's gonna start their pitches pretty soon. The tensions are high. We can all see each other's products now. We're scoping each other out. My late grandfather actually, he had like 15 pills to take a day. It would cause my grandmother so much stress to, she would have to take care of him. She felt like she had to be at that house every single minute of the day. And so, and he really struggled to use technology. I spent a lot of time helping him like learn how to email, how to use Microsoft Word. And so we wanted to design something that would be so intuitive that literally anyone could use it. And first place, which is a thousand dollar cash prize and from X Prize. From X Prize and five Fitbits. And our cross campus membership. And cross campus membership goes to Well, it's currently seven oh two PM Saturday, October fifth, and, and we, we just, just lost the inventathon. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> it was a great experience. Yeah, we the, the judges just came out and announced so the final decisions. The Got to see some awesome winners. There's a lot of cool ideas being bandied about today. It was yeah. very exciting. Unfortunately we didn't make the top three this time, but I hope we will get to compete again next year. And I think we learned a lot from this experience that'll help us next year.